Hi guys, this is Gabrielle, aka Hello Curly. And in this video, I'm telling y'all about a product that took all of my coins but delivered none of the results. Keep watching. Hey y'all, I'm back, 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 back again with another product review. This product, y'all, it was ultimate fail and I'm gonna tell you why, but this product is one of those products. Y'all ever have one that's been on your product junkie list for a minute? You done, you done wrote her out in your little wish list and you went and you went and got her and you just had all the most hopes and dreams and then they turn out to be an utter disappointment. Almost like for some of my girls who's on Tinder. Now I've never been, I don't do online dating, but I'm telling you, I can only imagine if you swipe, is it swipe left or swipe right? I don't know which one it is but i can only imagine if you swiped and you thought we here you know i done got me a little snack uh-huh and then you go into the day and they don't deliver nothing like kind of like sir are you a liar are you pathological does your profile sit something different and what you're presenting is totally different that's how i felt about this product what i was hearing about it what i thought it was gonna be it was not it now before i dove into that if you have not already hit that subscribe button just go do yourself a favor do yours bless your life bless your life jesus will bless you i mean i hope he does but jesus will bless you this review will bless you if you go ahead and hit the subscribe button please like comment and share if you enjoyed this video share it to your friends we're trying to get team hello curly up so do me a favor if you've liked any of my videos and if they've ever helped you hit the subscribe send it to home girl tell her hit the subscribe too and go watch some of the old videos too because they all good all right Let's hop into this review. Now, this product that I'm gonna be talking about, it is the Camille Rose. Okay, let me get all up in your grill so y'all can see. The Camille Rose Honey Hydrate Leave-In. Now, if you have been on the natural hair blogs like I am a lot, you would see that this leave-in was one, was part of a three leave-in series. It was one that was so coveted that it wasn't even in stores at that time. Excuse me, y'all. It wasn't even in stores at the time. It was one of those ones that you had to like be like on a wait list for, and then you had to get it from the website. And so I've waited for a minute because every time I wanted to get it on the uh, the little wait list, I never was in time for it. Kind of gone on my days where, y'all, I'm, I'm on nobody's wait list, all right? It got to be a really great product for that. So I just decided I would wait it out. There's a green tea in there. There's still like a milk something. So when I go to Target, aka Target J, and I see her on the shelf, I'm like, girl, I've been looking for you for a minute, okay? So I pick her up. I'm so excited. I get her home. <sighs> Y'all, if I'm going to tell you, I don't return a whole lot of products, but if I did, this would be one. But let's hop into all the SKUs that I normally say. This product is Fourteen dollars. All right. Now I do not pay a whole lot for my leave-ins. I have a lot of hair, so I try to keep my leave-ins in because I use a lot of it, a lot of product. I mean, I try to keep my leave-ins on the low low. All right. I try to make it as organic as it can be and on the low low. So fourteen dollars was already like, and uh, my wallet was looking at me like, but I was like, I'm gonna do it. So. Went and did it, got it, could not tell me nothing on my uh, little old time row. Can't nobody tell me nothing. All right, can't nobody tell me nothing. Wash my hair, do the jazz, and then I go to put it on my hair. And I'm wondering why my hair is so sticky. Now, I know this is honey, but I didn't think we was going to go full honeycomb with, with the product. Y'all, my hair was so sticky and greasy, okay? All right, let me, let me go to the ingredients list because I always hit y'all with that. So the first ingredient is honey. It's olive fruit oil, it's castor oil, it's aloe leaf juice, bilberry fruit, uh, maple, sweet orange, uh, street orange fruit, lemon fruit. So we had so much stuff. It has caramel in it. Okay, we probably could have skipped the caramel, all right? The caramel, if y'all watch Martin. Anywho, so let's say, so it has a lot of good ingredients, y'all. So I expected this to be the most nourishing thing for my hair, but I'm telling y'all, it's this hydrate and this is step one. About time you do the other steps, the hair will already be caked up. So I'm putting it on, oh, and smell, let me see. It smells just like honey, but a little more of a false honey. You know, like the honey they give you at IHOP, it ain't real honey, but they tell you it is. It's more like that, but, and I love honey and I love the scent of honey, so, but, I was expecting, I like the concept, but I wasn't expecting it to feel like honey on the hair, okay? So I, my hair is dripping wet. I've already in deep condition. I put her on and it's just feeling real greasy. Like it's just feeling really greasy. And so first I'm like, maybe I need to put some more on, you know, I don't know why, but when products get bad, you know, you start being like, okay, let me, let me double up. So I start putting some more and y'all, my hair just felt 
y'all it just felt so greasy that's all i could say is grease monkey the shine really wasn't there and then it was so weird because it also made my hair feel greasy but it also made it feel really dry too like i decided it, it was just like it was like if you just took a whole thing of honey and just put it on your hair like i don't think that it set well into the hair um the smell wasn't horrible or nothing on the hair but just the feeling itself was so weird and so i just kept putting it in trying to like kind of like get it to sink in but it wouldn't sink in really well so it just kind of laid on top of my strands so i let it sit for like about an hour hoping that it would eventually my hair would absorb it but that like never happened it just kind of sets felona was like girl i don't know what this is but we're not taking this we are not doing this so it just sat on the hair it was very greasy i was expecting a whole lot of shine from it no shine i decided to sleep with it and say oh, you know maybe some products are like that maybe it may be too heavy next day i'm gonna see if my hair wasn't crispy and weird, no styler would pair with this. No anything would pair with this. I mean, y'all, this was the most disappointing product I've had in a minute. I mean, all I could just say was crazy, slip, not slippery in the best way. It just felt oily. Like, my hair just felt like I put a lot of oils in it. And I know that it has castor oil in it. But it has so many other things in it, I thought that it would balance out. So, this is one of the products. I know a lot of people, like, really love the Trio line. I'm very nervous to try anything else from the Trio line because this... This was like a super letdown like I haven't even used it anymore and I gave it to my sister sometimes products that I don't do well with she may do well with and she the next day was like what was that like my hair is greasy and she's a short TWA she had to rinse her hair out after that and y'all it took even a lot to kind of get this out of my hair so I just don't get this this is one of the ones that's really confused me and I'm just kind of like man what are you what are you why did you lie to me okay now i'm a camille rose junkie there is not normally a product that i don't love from camille rose but this one right here was like gooky and it just it just didn't make my hair not feel clean i mean i just can't say how much oily and weird it was so i'm sorry guys i hope that that <laughs> i hope that helps and i hope that description makes sense so all i can say is like super oily didn't sit into the hair well laid on top of it which is strange, which is real strange. And I've not used it again. As you can see, nobody in my household has used it again. She is a full, how many fluid ounces is it? Nine fluid ounces, sis is a full nine fluid ounce still. All right, so guys, leave in the comments. Let me know if you tried this product and whether you like it or not. Definitely the worst $14 I'm gonna spend, but it's all right, it's part of the journey. I love you guys, thanks for watching and comment, like, subscribe. Besos.